Well, it is the great debate across the country right now. Clark was the number one overall draft pick for the WNBA, but her starting salary is drawing outrage. Clark is set to earn just over $338,000 over four years of her contract with the Indiana Fever. That's compared to last year's number one NBA draft pick, set to secure $55 million over that same four year span. NBC 5's Alana Quillen's live in Dallas following the conversation about this and about equal pay. Alana. Good morning. Yeah, uh, Clark's contract is shedding an even brighter spotlight on this conversation about pay disparity. But, you know, it's something that has been a frustrating norm in women's sports for years now. Now, the details on Clark's contract, she will earn a base salary of $76,000 for her first year, about $78,000 the second, and nearly $86,000 for the third, with a fourth year option of $97,500. That's despite her making history as college basketball's all time leading scorer during her time with the Iowa Hawkeyes. Her star power dubs the Caitlin Clark effect has also sold out games, brought in bigger ratings to women's basketball than ever seen before. Her team's national championship game drew in more viewers than the men's title game, the first time that that has ever happened. Now, all of this with her contract has sparked outrage on social media from male athletes and other sports uh, sounding off about this to even the president of the United States saying, quote, we're seeing that even if you're the best, women are not paid their fair share. This also really got Hoda and Jenna fired up on the Today Show yesterday. Take a listen. By the way, this is like picking at an old scab yeah. for many women. And there was something about it, like I was imagining the little girls with the signs who were filling the stadiums, who were now obsessed with basketball, with signs that say Caitlin. And society, I guess, is saying, well, this is what this is what that's worth right, right now. Now, the WNBA has yet to respond to all of this, although some are asking if it's even fair to compare the NBA and the WNBA because it's a business that, that dictates pay. In just television revenue alone, the NBA makes $2.7 billion a year. That's TV revenue, while the WNBA so far only makes $60 million a year. But again, all frustrations aside, excitement is building for Caitlin Clark to be in North Texas next month when she plays the Dallas Wings. And again, those tickets are expected to sell out very fast. Reporting live in Dallas, Alana Quillen, NBC5.